whatever. Damn. But I feel like everyone is like, that was, oh, oh, yeah, I, I, need, I need Daisy. Daisy. Uh, She's what? She's just more hip. She's more hype. Are you serious? More exciting. You know? She looks like a freaking bootleg version of Flintstones, man. Oh, like, get come on, here. man. I was always a fan of that. What was the Flintstone lady? Yeah, man. You don't even know her name, man. What's her name? Wilma? Wilma? Yeah, Velma? Wilma? Velma? I don't know. I don't no, know. Velma is a uh, is, uh, Scooby Doo. Yeah. That's another one, though. Oh, she's Chris. Yeah, she <laughs> Velma, dude. The intellectual. The intellectual, uh, yes. yes. That, that, that I can get behind. Oh, okay, good, good. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> there we go. Uh, putting in some names. I always love to see what tags they like to put in. Thank you so much to MVD. I appreciate people that have their tag as their thing. It's like, it sucks when you see people playing. You don't know who they are. I know you could kind of see that at the bottom of the screen. It says like, True. this guy is, you know, because he's on the right. But right. I just want to know. Who's yeah, yeah. Man. Just point blank. Yeah, absolutely, MVD. absolutely. Yeah, I really love that. And of course, shout out to all the people at home watching G6 here on 2G Gaming. Also, guys, remember you do have VG boot camp. That's happening right now. I believe they have a uh, Armada, Armada versus Armada. Pandarian. Yeah, Armada versus Pandarian. So it looks pretty sick. Uh, of course, also too that we do have a was it VGBC two going on. Some really good stuff uh, doing melee, melee. So if you guys want to see some melee, you can. But I know most of you guys came for that ultimate action. So thank you so much for joining us here. Hope you guys have been enjoying the action. Hope you guys have been enjoying the commentary. Of course, you know, sitting with one of the, the goats of the game, Mr. Keitaro, man. Really uh, did That's amazing things. <laughs> yeah, well, I think so, man. You did amazing things for the community. I know you hold it down, not just on the commentary on the sticks, but also with the people, man. Oh, kind of the father figure for a lot of these uh, a lot of these guys like Cosmos, Tweak, etc. But anyways, we're going to go into it now. Game one. Definitely game one. I don't know what that one is doing. But <laughs> well, MVD is already up a game apparently. Yeah, just like that. <laughs> Alright, this matchup is not too bad for Peach. Peach needs to just float around and uh, go aggressive on Snake. Already 92%. Sure. And Snake again has trouble landing. Grenade, it, I mean, it's not grenade. <laughs> he yeah. uses so many grenades, I yep. call them grenade. Yeah, MVD right. is a grenade master. He is. So you're going to see him use it as much as possible. Compared to Ally, you're going to see barely use it. Like MVD, any time he has a chance to throw it out, boom. Right. Yeah, I feel like, again, when you see uh, just the tilts and everything like that, that's really the mastery that Ally has. And uh, while he has the other stuff, it definitely feel like the specialist, uh, as far as the traps, is definitely MVD. That's that's what he lives off of. One thing I do like about what uh, MVD is doing is using the Nikita at these higher percents. He just knows, you know, I can just throw it out and it might be able to KO. Like, why, why would I not throw it out? But examples like that, you have to be very careful at how far away you decide to use Nikita. You can get True. caught. Man, he's looking for that attack. However, he doesn't want to hit the grenade, so Sod's playing it really safe. Wow. Man, was that, a, up. was that a boost up to? Oh, no. <laughs> the snake classic. You heard? You yeah, heard Daisy? Right, yep. Woohoo. <laughs> yeah. Paige should have been like, cool. You know, that's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Here we go. So that got you hype? <laughs> yeah. Woohoo. Yeah. All right, here we go. <laughs> I'm so angry. <laughs> all right, explosions coming in yep. handy. Good stuff. Up in the co You know, that hitbox is so huge, man. I feel like sometimes that. Animation doesn't do it justice. A lot of people just kind of get tricked in those scenarios. You got to be really careful. Uh, MD making it really hard to actually get a hit on him. He has like grenades, down bees, everything covering him. But here we go, grenade throw. I'm not going to get anything. All right, and I believe, correct me if I'm wrong, guys, but I believe MVD has been having a little bit of a Peach slash Daisy issue where he's been sure. losing to Peaches and Daisies. I think that's what he lost to at Glitch. Like even players that like you wouldn't say are the best Peaches in the world. So let's see how he does right now. Still doing pretty good. Ooh, Still gets that catch, grab. Yeah. Oh, and actually, he's going to the kill KO. Didn't even need to do like the down throw after. All right, let's see if we get that up throw. Up air, up air. Boom, there it goes. However, beautiful yeah. air dodge. And where did that oh, down beat come goodness, from? I don't know, but platform pressure, another oh, sticky. A sticky. Now. Oh, my. Oh, it fell on the ground oh right there. Goodness. I know. That would have been so good. Ooh. He could have actually maybe have gotten a fair there, yep. but he didn't expect to see him explode like that. That side B is so strong. Oh, good hit. That should be death. Oh, oh no. Unfortunately, it grabs the ledge. Yeah, it looked like um, it looked like Saj grabbed the ledge from the stake. Yeah, Saj's definitely. not paying attention to these down Bs. However, only 79%. He might be able to bring it back. Oh, my wow. God. Okay. <laughs> Beyond the grave. <laughs> Absolutely. The war never stops, man. All right, again, he has to watch out for where that downs. Uh -oh, oh, here we go. Oh, oh. no. Oh, here we go. Okay. Uh <laughs> wow. Oh, my goodness. Snake let him start the combo twice. Yeah, 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 twice. And that could have been very, very big damage. 
and I would have got on my corner carry. Potential could have been off the side of the stage. Good tag. All right, good st stuff right there. Deciding to dash attack in. Again, he has to watch out for that down B. Boom! Oh, my God. He is so lucky yeah, to not he get is, by he that. Is. He was not paying attention. <laughs> he did not see it. <laughs> he did not see it at all. All right, but 170%. MVD might go aggressive. Get that grab to down throw into up tilt since it 100% works at this percent. Got to watch out how you land. And it's getting to the point that grenades are almost going to be able to KO. So this is this will be really hard to imagine uh, Sajarina back because he needs to knock Snake off the stage and somehow get an early percent KO. Here it goes. That's one. Knock Snake off the stage. Has to watch out for the grenade. Okay, okay. Good catch. All right, MBD just going for that dash attack. They get a KO. Can KO. Oh, no. Bad timing. Oh. Boom. That's yep, it. Yep, done. Bad timing on that fairy. Tried to space a fair, retreating fair on MBD. However, MBD just simply rolled in. Was able to get that grab. Good stuff by him. That was scary. Yeah. Almost brought it back. All right, so here we go. Game number two. Let's see what stage choice we're going to see. I feel like Pokemon Stadium 2 is a really good stage for a snake. So I'm letting all you guys know. I have no idea how many people are watching. Be careful when it comes to picking the stage. It's perfect. The platforms are perfect where the down B can work really well. Yeah. The down B can hide on a certain gray part of the platform. Oh, yeah, yeah. And it's so snakes rough. like to throw the down B there. So you almost can't see it at all. Yeah. So be careful when it comes to PS2. Don't just go there. Oh, you want to go PS2 with your snake? Yeah, no problem. No, you're riding your own grave, man. Got to think about them real hard. True. And that's something that I think people are still not looking at right now. Even though it's one of people's favorite neutrals in the game, PS2 definitely uh, lends itself to certain characters. Yep. Uh, of course, it's very long stage, so a lot of owners really enjoy the space. Uh, characters like Sonic that want to have that space kind of maneuver around and really utilize their speed again. And then, of course, you know, even sometimes people will like to go to Hazardous Smashville. It's a kind of concept where that moving platform, that, oh, that staying platform in the center, mm -hmm. this could be really good for characters to get some uh, platform combos and it end stocks very early. So you got to be aware of what neutral you want to pick. Don't just be lazy and do whatever you want to do. One thing I feel bad for right now for Saj is that he's picking up these grenades, and I know he doesn't want to. He's like in the middle of a combo, and he picks up grenades, and then he has to throw the grenade before he can even try to continue the combo. And since he has to throw the grenade, he can't continue the combo. Yeah. And, okay, all these explosions. All right, I like that. He tried to make it, so it was really hard for Saj to approach on the ground. However, Saj just went high up anyway. So yeah. Peach, Peach has always been cool. Of course. All right, watch out for that down B. Ooh, just barely hopped above it. Oh, what happened? Oh, I'm out of loss. I'm out of loss. He actually had a, quite a bit of a lead against Pandarian, but he just lost right there. Unfortunate for Armada, but that was winning bracket. Pandarian, amazing player. Let's see, running up to 94%. Should be able to get. Oh my gosh, throw that grenade. Made it look like he can approach because he threw it too far. Yep. Nope. He got run up into it. Alright, Massage getting the first stock this time around. Ooh, okay, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Gosh, yeah. That up smash, I'm happy to see more snakes using it more often. That up smash is really good at stuffing people out. People don't expect it to come out. You throw out the up smash and it just hits later. Yeah, so it's sure. good for setting a trap. All right, good. Keeping snake in the air. One more? Nope. Here's the thing about snake where it seems like you would like to trade versus snake, but or like uh, or it's good for snake to trade, but you're doing damage. Oh, what is oh, that? Oh, it's this face. Oh, we're going up. Not going to KO, though. But it seems like it's uh, good for Snake to trade. However, you're doing damage to Snake and he explodes while you just get explode while you just explode. Yeah. So if you're not that light of a character, it's actually not that bad for you. Alright, turn up. Let's see, can you get oh no upbeat coming out? Yeah, very surprised when you see upbeat uh, there. Definitely would have ended the stock. Let's sit back. Yeah, I love the patience here from Saw trying to maneuver around this minefield. Yeah. The up air. See, I love that again. That was that turnaround grenade into run away slightly grenade again. He's like, come on, try yep. to approach me. My down yeah. B's ready for you. Where are you? Oh my gosh. Okay. And he got the up air, but it's not gonna KO. Again, the grenade tra trade. This one might actually be good for Snake because that up tilt is at the percent. Wow, oh, the up tilt actually almost KO'd from near yeah. center stage. Very, very close. And have to watch out for that up smash again. Can he land? Wow, just explosions everywhere. Okay, the bomb down. Oh, tries to go for an up smash to kind of cover his options there, but Sasha's going to get up really early. That's the scary thing out. about that up smash. It looks like, you know, it's a hitbox that comes out and it's not a part of you. However, you can just smack through it. Yeah. Some, some attacks just go through it. Like, Wolf's neutral air can go through two up smashes at once. Absolutely stupid, but that's Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's ridiculous. Clean. Oh, okay. The drop face. There we go. Mm -hmm. Here we yep. go. 
Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Dead. wow. Yep, that's all real. What in the world? Yeah. Peach. Okay. I just thought he was going to do some damage. Not going to KO from near the blast zone. My goodness. Good stuff by Saj. Able to get that sock again. MVD having a little bit of Peach trouble. Maybe not Peach trouble. Or Daisy. Yeah. Oh, same character. I, I just wanted to hear you say Peach. I already said Peach. Well, here we go. Having trouble against Daisy. And Peaches. <laughs> it might have been that stage choice that could have definitely affected something. Or just that one combo that Saj got in at the end. Yeah, definitely. Because, I mean, uh, MVD was definitely on pace. Uh, looking really, really good in that matchup. But finally, Saj was able to actually complete one of those dangerous peach uh, princess combos and that's really what you got to look for when you're going up in these characters that's really where they made my money so all right and it looks like we're going to is that town and city again I'm not too sure we'll find out in just a moment yeah just a moment daisy all right i love the color daisy i love the pink color favorite color here we go I like match number color. three mvd will he get upset early let's from see Saj. Oh, okay whoa Interesting stage choice coming out from MVD. These platforms are really high, so I actually don't know if the down B will hit. But oh, that's one thing about these platforms. You see how the way the way the stage is usually? Mm -hmm. If you put the platforms on, uh, or you put the down B on the platforms, you can't see it. Yeah, you can't see it at all. Yeah, like right now. Yep. Interesting choice from MVD. Yeah, and I think it still hits people who are just standing. Yeah. Uh, so most people. So it's actually pretty good. So overall, how do you feel about this matchup? Of course, uh, you you've been playing that snake. Ultimate uh, quite often. I've seen you uh, do that a lot of times on your streams as well. Um, uh, it doesn't feel bad. Sorry. She's yeah. Jumping. Right. So if she's jumping, you can get a lot, a lot of up tilts. Um, you just kind of roll behind her. That's what we saw in BD go for um, before. It's not bad. It just might. You might have some trouble landing, but I'd say it's like near even. Wow. Yep. Of course. And there goes that down B on the platform. Yep. So good. Oh my, oh my goodness, gosh. man. That too. was a setup. Almost made me think it was a combo. Yeah. I mean, we might see MVD going for these up tilts now. MVD not really an up tilt type of player though. He's more so like, I'm just gonna hit you with all these traps. Like until you just bend exactly. the guy. Yeah, he loves it. He will go for up tilts like after certain traps in those kind of situations, but he is a trap mastermind. That's what he loves to do. He loves to play that game. Um, that's how he goes about he's a neutral for the most part. He usually just tries to set up nades around people and then eventually they if My they give him enough time, they run into it, and it limits their options. Well, it actually didn't do that much damage, but he had that grenade out. Did the down throw. Made sure it did not hit him, but did hit Daisy. Yeah. And that down beat right there at the ledge, it's so scary. It makes you feel like you're afraid to actually run to the ledge. True. I actually like the placing of that. Good nair. Gonna hit him through no. the minefield. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I'm that's combo. actually a combo. Okay, clean. Which is uh, guaranteed in certain situations as well. A snakes will do that, so be careful when you get hit with that grenade grab. All right, one more up there. Oh my gosh, she actually almost got him with that. Uh, he tried to land over to the left so that he could get the down B to connect. And again, that down B put at the ledge, so if he does get knocked off on the left side of the stage, Saj will be afraid to actually go over there and try to head guard. True. Oh, okay. Nice. Good swing. We're looking at 116, uh, now 131. Saj is going to really have to find something to really bring back this death set. All right, I appreciate the Nikita. Using Nikita as a trap, actually, instead of trying to go for the KO. And wow, so immediately going for these down Bs. He doesn't like to keep them on the ground too long. Look at that. He just likes to explode them as fast as he can. Okay. Are we gonna and I love that. Crazy combo? Because I feel like sometimes when he does that, it makes his opponent feel like they see the nades going off at certain times, yeah. and then they'll forget about the C4s that he doesn't do immediately. Wow, that was a really good down air coming out. Onto MVD, but it doesn't even matter. He's able to punish. And this is the tricky part. This is where you do not want to trade. When you're a stock down, Snake just wants you to keep hitting him. And yep. the grenade at the same oh, time. And trying to go for the Nair 1 setup, that's something I, I really love to do with myself as Snake, where you go for a down throw, and then if you have a read on their rolling patterns, you jump forward, go for Nair 1, and sometimes it can uh, net you a uh, re grab back in the down throw. Good stuff with the up tilt. And that's going to close out the game, and MVD moves on. Yeah, that was really good stuff coming out from MVD. Was able to just never really get touched. He didn't let uh, Daisy do anything. Daisy was just always outside the range trying to deal with the grenades and deal with the up tilt, and that's why he was able to take that game. Yeah. Uh, surprising to not see that work on the town and city, but worked really well on Unova. Yes, absolutely, absolutely. All right, so let's see what uh, people are coming up next. 
I want to see some more awesome uh, top players jump on the stage. And wow, that's so crazy. Okay. Uh, oh man, yo, K9. I haven't seen K9 all day. What up, K9? Right, man, my man good. is looking fresh. Blue Titi is actually losing right now. Oh, one's so I'm hip. The guy that was able to take three sets off. of Oh, the okay. Yeah. I'm hip is actually that damn good. This yes. is a guy that I think people have been very much sleeping on. Yes. He right, is yeah, extremely start, talented. Right. All right, I don't know. Uh, we're, we're hearing something, but we can't. All right, guys. Oh, sorry. Uh, we're going to be start X-Split. Yeah, guys. So uh, <laughs> we're going to be right back. Take a quick break. We're going to uh, restart X-Split. Yeah. And then uh, we'll get back into this amazing match. I believe we're going to have K9 versus Salem. So definitely oh, wow. don't go anywhere. It's going to be super sick. Stay tuned, guys. All right, you're good. You're good. Okay. What do you mean, do you mean we're good? No, All right. you don't have to close anymore. Oh. oh. <laughs> 